Happy Wednesday, y'all. Um, yay, you made it halfway through the week. Okay, so same drill. By now, hopefully you have done the do now, listing what are three different soft skills that we are using during the sewing unit. Um, today we are doing our stitch sampler, which you'll have today and tomorrow to do, so don't stress, okay? So again, we're gonna be able to demonstrate basting, running, slip stitch, and button. Remember, ask your table mates for help if you need help. Now, don't have them just do your starting knot for you because you need to be able to know how to do that, but you can always ask for help. Remember to advocate for yourself. Self-advocacy is a soft skill, so there's one answer for you, okay? All right, so today we are getting a new piece of fabric for our sampler, okay? So everyone is getting a purple felt square, and that is your one piece of fabric that you are getting, okay? So don't lose it. Don't take it out of the classroom. Don't lose your bag, right? Keep it, keep all your stuff together. Figure out how to manage all your materials. Um, but that is your piece of fabric that are, you are using, okay? So you have today and tomorrow to do it, all right? So it's gonna look something like this. Um, we've gone over this yesterday too, but basting stitch, running stitch, slip stitch member is also like known as the invisible stitch and then sewing on a button. Um, you are going to open up your sewing workbooks to the hand sewing rubric so that you can see what makes a three or a four. So use this to guide you right in how you're doing. Um, you need to have a sewing tray on your table group, a ruler, your sewing materials from your plastic bag. Oh, not practice fabric. Like you need your, your purple one. I'll change that. And your sewing workbook. All right. So same deal as yesterday, but now this is your project. So you're going to work on your stitches using your rubric and a ruler. You do not need to finish it all today. You have tomorrow, so please do not rush, okay? Um, please do the four required stitches before you do the bonus points, right? Again, put all your things back in your class period's black crate that's labeled in the right folder. Um, you can be a decent human by maybe collecting your whole table group's sewing workbook. So one person can put that away. Another person can put the bags away. Prep your sewing tray for the next class period. Clean up your threads and scraps on and under your table and push in your chair. Please pick up pins and needles if you see them on the ground. Hopefully there's not any on the ground, but we don't want those getting like swept away at nighttime and thrown away. And um, we want to keep our needles and pins with our things. All right. I hope y'all have a good day. Love you. Bye.